strangely, Hikaru blundered against Josephine Heinemann, but we don't know where. Okay, it looks dominating. It, for his it last looks move, dominating. F six. Where just, was it? Just Rover, Queen of six. He wanted mate, but he walked right into Bishop well, G five. I mean, I'm gonna assume yeah. he did that on purpose, but he must have missed some sort of follow up. Right, like yeah. he, he must think because he's just the queen winning the but... e4 pawn. The queen winning the e4 pawn is the key, right? It, when the queen comes to e4, if you show Robert, that guards the h4 square, preventing queen h4 for black. So the exchange sack isn't just a uh, isn't just a way to win. And obviously, we know Hikaru is is going to get the job done for you this year, Levy. But obviously, this is a position that has kind of gotten away from the man. But let's see. What what kind of chances does he have? Actually, C4 is coming. What is going on here? This is not and, looking great at all. And maybe this is what he yeah. missed. The knight just comes back to F1 and stops the mate. Yeah. Yeah. Are, are you, might, you guys might be ahead of me. I, I have the events page open. So I, I don't uh, then see we are. I then we are. moves. But yeah. Well, if you look at yeah, the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The... the uh, okay, well, we apologize for that. And again, that is by design, everybody, for, for fair play reasons. But... Um, Hikaru in a in a bit of trouble here and in, in live fashion, kind of shaking his head a little bit. So this would be talk about a, a crazy turnaround and a, and a shocker as we we left this one what we thought was for good. Um, but all right. Um, oh no! Lay, yeah, yeah. Lay, sorry, I, the job done. Sorry, guys. I I I totally forgot that uh, it's been a while since I joined the broadcast. I, I forgot you guys have a board here. I don't have to look at the one on my screen. Uh, yeah, ninety three night F one seems to have been. But I. I think I think part of it is also he just he you know he might have started the match just a, a bit relaxed right like he played a very very yeah. offbeat opening and he but he still got a completely winning position and he just thought okay I'm just going to deliver checkmate and that will be the end and yeah uh, yeah this is a well this is a worst nightmare situation but <laughs> there's uh, there's eight points still to be gained as a team and I think we're pretty good on the other boards but I haven't looked so now I'm kind of terrified. Well it's it's true. Liam Lay is getting the job done against Frederick Swane at this at this time, um, and Natalia Buxa also looking. She's down on the clock, but the position is interesting against Rasmus Swane. So, but still, you know, we hate to have you be here and to have things go so weirdly wrong, Levy. But uh, yeah, weird start for the Gotham Knights, and uh, we'll, we'll see where it goes in the rest of the day. No, listen. As Hikaru has said before, uh, he uh, he he's a streamer first, so he's got to do things in the most dramatic fashion. You know, so now we got to get <laughs> the content. Now, now all the storylines, the narratives are going to be out there. Of uh, yeah, but I, I'm, I'll stay positive. I'll be happy with a two-two round one. Uh, we are a rating favorite, I think, on three of these boards. They're yeah. a very, very good team, but obviously we'll we'll hope for the best. That's all. That's all I. Well, can Levy, do. before Everybody I let you go, if last I'm playing, question. And I'm like, no. La last question, because I saw fans asking in chat. We've seen some teams sporting some pretty sexy swag. The Blitz had jerseys. You've got the Berlin Bears with the hoodies. The fans want to know how long until the Levy Rosman Gotham chess merch and will Gotham Knights merch be a part of that? I can't I can't just use this same Wingardium Levy Rosman mug forever, bro. Yeah, that was before I even had facial hair. That's like the old Gotham, you know what I mean? Uh, I think there there is a result, so Liam did get the job done. Uh, yeah, so we actually have a wait list. We have GothamMerch.com. I've been working with, uh, okay. with Fourth Wall. We're going to probably get a, a nice hoodie design. It's just, you know, we I, I really want it to be super nice. Uh, there's an M in the evaluation in Hikaru's game on the board, which is absolutely unreal. That knight on F1 is an absolute <laughs> goat. Speaking of, it's, 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 the, it's a knight that's the goat, but it's not, the, it's not playing for our team. Uh, yeah. So yeah, we will have some merch, and I, I hope to do a big Gotham merch drop like in the few in uh, twenty three for myself. But I want it to be super nice. I don't want you know there to be threading and for it to be poor quality. So like a typical yeah. creator uh, merch drop. So yep. Well, good stuff, man. The fans will eagerly await that. Let's get some Gotham Knights merch in it too. And good luck to the team the rest of the way. Maybe maybe this is the drama that the people wanted. Hikaru, as you said, he's a streamer first, content first, and we are going to have drama now. With this with this board one upset so good luck man and we'll uh we'll talk to you later yep thanks guys cheers yeah see, see you soon levy wow danny i mean i can't believe I, I'm, it i'm shocked it was it's was so funny because like that that script was supposed to go very differently we were supposed to have international master levy rosman talk about recruiting hikaru celebrate hikaru's first victory here and instead the gloves came absolutely off the wheels came off wow 
And look at her. She is jubilant here. She was trying not to celebrate, but you can tell that this yeah. may be the happiest moment of her chess life. She's a very strong player, but she just took down Hikaru.